Teachers, I want to show you how easy it can be to create an end of the year video with your iPad in pictures and even videos that you've taken on your iPad. Um, I am in iMovie right now and I've opened it up. I do have a quick little movie that I just made and just to show you, I'll go ahead and go to the edit part of it. And you'll notice right here I've added some pictures and I've also added some music. I was able to add a video and then an ending giving credit to the um, music that I got. So let me just play it real quick here. Notice it's for time duration, which was a picture. It also uses something like called Ken Burns, which will make it move. And these are all things you could adjust and change. And then the video is going to click in. Take a picture of any object or... Okay, and I'm not going to finish that right there. I'm going to go ahead and click out of here. And I'm going to show you, I'm going to go back to projects and very quickly how you could create um, your own movie. Notice I tapped on the plus sign there and it asked me if I want to do a trailer or a movie. I will select movie for this. And then immediately it puts you into where do you want to get the media. Um, mine were in my photos and I can simply click on the ones that I want right here. And then I tap on Create Movie. And then I also had that one video that I wanted to add in there. And I will click on that. And if it's what I want to, if I tap on that, notice the yellow that pops up. I'm going to tap on the plus. That will add that in there as well. And then the bend sound, I forgot. Um, I put that in there for the credits. And I took a picture of that. So I need to go back to media. It takes a little bit to kind of learn to navigate here. But I'm going to go ahead and add that in. So you can see now I have all the different components. Um, it's pretty easy. They put in there. I decided I wanted this picture in the beginning. So notice I just take my finger. I pick it up. I'm holding it down. And I just move it to where I see the white line saying I want it up front. Um, I had some music. So here's the media right next to it. I'm tapping on audio. And I had some saved in my iCloud Drive. And that's one way that I found easy to transfer things. And notice that it just plunks it in there. Um, there's many different ways to modify the sounds and stuff like that. But basically when you're done, you need to tap on done. The important thing is now it's not quite done. Um, I need to tap on the little box with the arrow and share out. And I would like to save this video. And I'm going to save it as HD 720. It takes a little bit to export it. This is an important thing. If you don't do this, you're going to be sharing out a project and that will not work. It says it's in your photos library. And I will just tap out of there and go to my photos library. And it should be this video right here. And if you want to be able to share it out with parents, you can probably just put this in like your Google Drive. And then um, once it's in Google Drive, you can do the sharing rights and share that out with parents. So hopefully, this is an easy way that you could create a video for your classroom. If you want any help, please let me know. I'd be more than happy to help you. And hopefully this Take Two for Tech will help make your end of the year awesome.